How are we doing? I hope you're all spot on. Thanks for watching the video. Now, I hear Burger King have got a new burger out. And please excuse me if I get this pronunciation wrong. I think it's the chimichurri burger. Now, they do them in beef and they do it in chicken. So, let's take a drive to Burger King. I did a, a Burger King um, a few videos back. I did the triple whopper. And I got it from a service station and yeah, it was a little bit expensive. So this burger is new. Uh, we have to try it, don't we? Um, the other burger, I've got a, a burger playlist. If you want to have a look at that, just click in the uh, burger playlist and you'll be able to find it in there. So we're here um, and there's no one here at the drive through we're first in which is good well when I say first in we're in smoky chimichurri and here it is um, it didn't come in a Burger King bag <laughs> I don't know if that's the new kind of bags they do nowadays just a brown bag and um, there was no serviettes I did ask him but it was it's raining and I'm parked up and I thought, I said to him, I said, uh, I've got my own anyway, so I didn't want it to get wet. <laughs> uh, so that's what you get. It's a Gourmet King Burger. It's Aberdeen Angus. You can get a, a beef or a crispy chicken. And I opted for the beef. So there it is. That's what you get. Did I say the price before? It was seven eighty nine. Quite easy to remember, isn't it? Seven eight nine. Seven pounds and eighty nine pence um, for for that. That's what you get. So you get um, like a brioche bun. And you get some um, salad in there. Looks like a bit of is it rocket lettuce. You get a burger, Aberdeen Angus burger, and you get onion and cheese, and you get that sauce as well on it. The churri, 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 is it? <laughs> um, th that's, that's, and you get some sort of, some more bits and bobs of sauce and, and sort of crispy onions on the bottom. Seven eighty nine. The burger is like, um, it's not round, it's, it's sort of like a bit jagged, if that's the right word. So you can get this in chicken as well. Seven pound and eighty nine pence. Yeah, yeah. If you know about the bag situation at Burger King, let me know because it just come in a brown bag like that. Yeah, it doesn't say anything on here actually. It just says Gourmet King. Yeah. Um, no information of calories or anything really. Um, I had to wait for it as well, just pulled me around uh, into the parking bay and he handed me the bag. Um, there was no serviettes, I did say, and he he, he sort of went, Ugh. I said, it's all right, I've got some. It was been pouring down as well. Right, let's get into this. If you kind of like this video, give it a thumbs up and maybe consider subscribing to the channel. And let me know the um, if you'll be ordering one of these. Mmm. It's quite tasty. Mmm, it is quite tasty. It's not dry neither. It's a little bit spicy. Not a lot, but it is tasty. It's quite sweet as well. Yeah, I'm liking it. The bun has stayed together as well. Uh, I did I did a Whopper, a triple Whopper. I got it from a um, service station on the motorway. And the, the top of the bun, it just disintegrated, totally fell apart. So thank you all for the comments about that one as to why it fell apart. I got a, a lovely message off um, someone who used to work in Burger King. 
and they said the reason why the bun disintegrates is that they come in frozen and it might have been defrosted quickly or it was stale and that was someone who used to work there so it was just a shame that that, that one I had fell apart this bun is, is keeping together you know which is good because it's a brioche bun it's a different type of bun this is tasty it is Mmm. It's lovely. It is tasty. It's not too spicy. It's a little bit spicy, but not like there's no like heat in there or anything. It is it's 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 a good it's a good tasty burger. I like it. It's probably one of the best ones I've had at the moment from Burger King. Mmm. Mmm, I like it. I don't like the price though. <laughs> but, you know, I mean, that's just the prices. It's, it's, it's a shame, but that's the prices we have to pay, unfortunately. Um, and you can see why the place is empty. Because it's just too expensive for the for the average person. I mean, all right, it's a gourmet burger, but seven pound and eighty nine is it's just too much. It's too much money, and you know, just the average person you can't afford that. Um, you, you know, you, you take a family of four in there, um, and then like like I'm just going off, you know, I'm just going off what I think, and obviously all the comments that I get from previous takeaway burger videos from all the fast food outlets which I've done it's just far too expensive it's just so expensive anyway that's me rant over there you know it is tasty mind which is I'm glad of mm. I will put a A link in the description to my burger playlist and at the end of this video above my head probably this side because there's more room you'll see some boxes and one will be me burger playlist and another one will be a video that you that will come up next um, and you can click on them boxes to watch them I just thought I'd mention that yeah, I mean, I, I'm, I'm going to stop in a minute. I'm not going to let you see me eat all this. The burger is the burger's lovely. It's well, it's well cooked. It's nice and moist and juicy. Um, the actual burger itself is cooked well as well. Not overly done. It's not dry. It's quite tasty. I, I like it. I do like it. Mmm, that is tasty. Well, thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate it. Please let me know your comments. And also, that's what I was going to say. In the description, I will put what chimichurri is, what it actually is. It's it, it's like, um, a kind of, reminds me of kind of a Mexican sort of spice. Um, It's tasty. I like it. I think it's the first time I've ever had it, I think. Chimichurri sauce. And yeah, I'll have to investigate, see if you can get, say, bottles of the sauce. I like it. So thanks very much for watching. Do appreciate it. Mmm. I'm going to eat that, that's for sure. In the description as well, I'll also put the calories. But... With it being a burger, it's got cheese on it as well. You'd be happy to know. I got a lot of comments about the triple whopper I had, and it, a lot of comments were, "Where's the cheese?" I don't think I've ever had a whopper with cheese before. I'll have to give it a go. It's always come without cheese. Anyway, I'm going on. Thank you very much for watching. Do appreciate it. Um, it's a, a rainy Monday, and uh, I hope the sun is shining wherever you are. So take care, all the best, and I'll catch you on the next one.
And I'll just turn this off there.